Welcome back to a more Amy Plays Crappy Frozen Games. In the last episode, we played a bunch of fun games like Baby Anna Frostbites, Elsa Frozen Magic, Frozen Elsa Hospital Recovery, and two baby games. Uh, in this one, we're going to start with Elsa Magic Rescue. We freeze everyone. Ice touching clean water only long press the magic ice cube to pull water press and drag the mouse to draw lines. I don't know what that means. What are we doing? I don't think I get this game. Oh, I'm trying to. Okay, I get it. I get it. It's like, it's, um, it's like, where's my water? Oh, and then you have to click it to melt the water. I get it. I get it! Be freed, Anna! Hooray! I have to freeze Anna and Kristoff. Or free. I'm just going straight down. Thing I can do. Is that gonna work? Or is there not enough water for that? There might not be enough water. I'd like to free my friends, but I might not have enough water to free my friends. I'll free Kristoff. See if we can get on him. Nope! Ah! Not quite. Okay. Try this again. I probably want to make this like as close to the thing as I possibly can. Oh, I guess I also could have. Well, we'll see if this works. If not, I guess I could have made like a, a bridge there. But I think this might be enough right now. Oh, I did it. Boom. You got not frozen. Speed up snowflake. Ice water will speed when passing through. Go! Go faster! Free Olaf. Free him. Hooray, we did it. Oh no, you can see my name. Oh no. Hmm. I don't want to do this. That. And then. That. Like a hill there. And then like. Go! Oh, I'm totally missing Chris off there though. Completely. It's kind of just shooting up. I'm totally missing all of them. Okay. Anyway, that's this game. It's a puzzle game. I don't want to spend too much time on that because it's not that exciting. So now we're going to play Frozen Block Party. Kristoff lives high in the mountains where he harvests and sells ice to the king of Arendelle. Help Kristoff and his best friend Sven collect the ice they need for the day. Drag, match, and release. Collect items, put them in the, so it's like, like, super Tetris. Okay, so it's like a puzzle. There's some ice. There's some ice. There's some ice. Oops, I did too many. Sorry, Chris. Um. Go stacking with spin. Click on spin when the ice meter is full, or there's no ice left. You can stack your cart. Oh, yeah. 
that. Uh, might have screwed up a little bit. That's okay. I think we did it. Can I go like this way too? No, but it has to be, has to face the same direction. It's a little obnoxious. But, silly. Uh, just do this right here. Oh, we're full. It's kind of like Tetris. Can I rotate it? Nope. Oh, but you can do that, so that's fine. Pure eyes. That gets you bonus points. Go ice harvesting with Crystal. I'm not ready to go ice harvesting. Well, to win. Okay. I sold. We got some money. We wasted some ice. Oops. This is not as easy as you would think. Actually, I'm just bad at puzzle games. I'm just bad at games in general. If we're being completely honest here. Day complete. We got 77, 177 coins, four bows, zero suns. My high score is that. Actually, it's fun in this game. Exchange summer items for collectibles to decorate your home. Use gold to buy upgrades, bigger hearts, new levels, and more time. So you can buy some stuff and keep ice harvesting. This game looks like you could play it for a very long time. So that was Frozen Block Party. <laughs> this one I'm excited for. Uh, this is Elsa's Ice Bucket Challenge. So it's like the the huge uh, ice bucket thing that was going around a while ago. So, our favorite sisters. Hey Elsa, you have a letter from Princess Anna. <laughs> this is gonna be great. Hey Elsa, I just nominated you for the ALS Ice Bucket Challenge, Anna. Of course, is it really gonna be that big of a deal for Elsa? Help Elsa design an ice gazebo. She will take the ice bucket challenge there. It's fun. It's cool. Elsa's a freaking nerd. So we're going to help her design the gazebo first. Because she can't just get water dumped on her head. No, no. We have to design a, a gazebo for that first. This is canon. This is canon, folks. I designed it. I drew it. Hmm. This is my drawing in skills in real life, too. I'm this great of an artist. I can just kind of um, dice where lines would come out. Exactly how I pictured them. Okay, I did it. Hmm. Like this one. You gotta put a fountain in there. Come on. That was the obvious choice. This is kind of an impressive... Also goes above and beyond here. I'm just clicking. I'm just clicking. That's beautiful. Elsa, you are amazing. Olaf's gonna fill the bucket. Oh, it's just clicking again. And of course, I'm vibrating because I put the ice in there because that's gonna. This <laughs> is snowing. What am I doing? What is the point here? This says go in a circle. What's the circle for? I don't understand what the circle is. I don't understand this part. No, wait, please. I, I'm, I'm having fun with this game. Don't let me lose this game. I 
Oh, they're just okay. Got it. I don't know why it was necessary to click there, but Okay, I'm ready for the challenge now. Help Ahana pull the rope by clicking the screen when the snowflake is in the green area. Where are we? Oh, we're clicking on Ahana. The snowflake goes really slow. I should just like click continuously while it's in the green area. There we go. Oh. <laughs> She's like, oh, that was like a nice, nice shower. Dressuphoo.com has already donated $100 to ASLA.org. Uh, that is a disease that affects the nerve cells in the brain and spinal cord. To learn more about ALS and also donate, please visit ALSA.org. That's really cool. I need a new outfit. Could you help me? Yeah. Yeah, I'll help you also. Oh, that's cool. I say I don't like dress-up games, and then I like go play these dress-up games, and I'm like, this is amazing. So maybe I do actually really enjoy dress-up games. I like this, and I like it with this. Oh, that's so pretty. Oh, this one's really cool. You can't even see the shoes. But I'm sure these are all fabulous. Oh, that's amazing. It's amazing. 10 out of 10. I like to nom nominate Cinderella, Snow White, and Rapunzel. That's amazing. I like it. Good job. Uh... I'm trying to decide if we have time for this one. Okay. We're going to attempt to play Elsa's Magic Ice Cream in three minutes. And if not, this is what we'll start. Choose only four... Oh, okay. This will be easy. Choose only four ingredients for the ice cream. I'm assuming we want ice in our ice cream. Milk, sugar, and we'll do some chocolate ice cream. Elsa's hair is red. So, uh, who knows, maybe her hair got sunburned? Olaf does not like that ice cream. So, I guess that was the wrong ingredients. That seemed to make the most sense to me. Eggs? Like, what do you want from me, Olaf? Do I not need ice in it? There we go. What? It was too good to be true. Let's put, like, the least the ingredients that don't make any sense in there. And see what happens. I like, like, this ice towel or whatever. Haha, <laughs> very funny, Elisa. <laughs> Lisa. This is like the let's please don't sue me. Oh, I'm fucked. I don't remember what combination to be is now. I'm just messing around. Can you even win this game? Is it possible? Who knows? Oh, he never liked me. He does like you, Olaf. You don't know him. Can you even eat? Apparently, according to Frozen Fever, he can. Maybe. Who knows? Oh, I guess that was what I used last time. Well, this has been Amy Plays Crappy Frozen Games. Uh, this is like the fun episode. There's nothing traumatizing in this one. I don't think. So, yeah. Tune in next time. Maybe we'll Maybe we'll play some traumatizing games. Okay, bye.